This particular example that we're looking at here is a beautifully restored 3.5 coupe and it is a very low production number on these cars because of the fact that this is a European factory four-speed stick shift car. This is this is the nicest example of a restored car that I've seen uh, in a while. Uh, a lot of attention to detail was uh, uh, done to this car. It it's, was finished on a factory silver uh, color, 180G, over its factory blue interior and um, restored with a white uh, steering wheel on the inside. Just a beautiful interior and upgraded with a bare air conditioning unit. Uh, pretty much a completely uh, done car. Uh, paint, interior, chrome, wood. Uh, wood done by Madeira Concepts. Uh, one of the nicest uh, or the best place in the US for uh, wood refinishing. Um, the car was also uh, done with uh, factory uh, mag wheels. Bunt wheels, what they call them. Uh, this is a car that you can tell by looking at it closely that uh, no expense was uh, spared. I mean, they just everything that they could have been done was done. Uh, the rear license plate light European, of course, three five, and again here we're looking at one of the lowest production cars because of the fact that they only built like two hundred of them or so or maybe even less and who knows how few are left with uh, uh, because of them being rusty burnt over the years and all that uh, it was finished with a beautiful ebony wood uh, a stick shift is just a fun car to drive it really gives you a sporty sportier feel so let's take a look under the hood so you, so you can see what uh, nice detail was done under the under the hood a lot of detail went in this engine bay it done very nicely it was done with the factory um, Mercedes battery uh, a lot of attention to detail with the detail in the radiator and beautiful ID tag uh, by the way, this is chassis number 21. So this is the 21 car built by Mercedes-Benz. It is a factory 180G. Um, it uh, has the um, foam in between the radiator and the core support, which is for uh, the proper cooling. Um, again, by adding the bare air conditioning unit, it just makes this car so nice and unique. One nice or an unusual thing that you see on these cars is that in the first 40 or 50 3.5s were with a spin-on oil cap, something that is just, they got away f uh, from it because of the cost of manufacturing, more than likely. But let's take this beauty out for a ride, guys, so that you can get a feel for the stick, stick V8. So we are now taking this uh, really nice 3.5 uh, stick coupe for a drive and just to get a feel for um, uh, it's, it's power and responsiveness, nice shifting, you know, third gear, fourth gear, down shifting. It really gives you, it really gives you a sense of control on, on the car when you do that. But these were just a delight to drive. The car, uh, by adding the uh, bare air conditioning unit, it, it, just, it just enhances the interior. Uh, and again, you guys can see that the the ebony wood is just a beautiful. It um, uh, gives it a beautiful look to it. Again, when you drive these, it's just the stick just makes it different. It's like you're driving a, a Porsche or or a, a Ferrari. It, you can really get a feel for the for the power of the engine.